good morning to all first of all i would like to introduce myself i am suganti head department of physics in border arts and science college for women devia kurchi today we see about digital electronics now we see about number system and codes first one is the what is meant by digital electronics digital electronics is a branch of electronics which deals with digital format of data and codes digital is stand for digit Digital electronics has basically two conditions the values of 0 and 1 digital electronic systems use only a digital signals that are composed to mathematical futures to do any work digital electronic circuits are usually created large number of logic circuit next one is number system in digital electronics the number system is used for representing the information there are different bases of number system the first one is binary second one is octal third one is decimal fourth one is hexadecimal next what are the types of number system here the types of number system the first one is binary the binary number system contains only two numbers that means 0 and 1 it has a radix or basis 2 here the example is a switch a switch can exist totally two condition the first state is zero zero represents the off state one is represents the on state next one is octal octal number system contains only eight numbers it means 0 to 7 it has a radix or base of 8 next one is hexadecimal the hexadecimal number system contains only 16 number of 0 to 9 and a to f it has a radix of base of 16 here the example is hexadecimal number is used for 16 bit microprocessor next one is logic gate logic gates are usually to create a large number of logic circuit there are three elementary basic logic gates that are and gate or gate and not gate each gate has its own logical symbol which allows complex function to be represented by a logical diagram the functions of each gate can be represented by a truth table or using boolean functions totally there are three basic gates the first one is the and gate the and gate has the following simple and truth table here represent the and gate and truth table and boolean functions the first one what is and gate the and gate has two or more input produces only one output signal the input signal is represent the a and b the output is represent as c here the truth tables are given what is the formula for truth table the combination of input signal is 2 power n the combination of input signal is 2 power n here n is represents the number of input signal here the number of input signal is 2 the number of input signal is 2 makes a combination of four input signal that four input signal is a b is the input c is the output here totally four inputs are produced here the totally two inputs are high the output is also high if any one of the inputs are low the output is also low that is the truth table for and gate here the boolean functions of and gate c is equal to a dot b it is a product of and gate next one is the or gate the or gate has a following symbol and a truth table here two or more input produces out only one output signal here the two tables are given totally four inputs are produced the first one is the two inputs are high the output is also high if any one of the inputs are high the output is also high if both inputs are low the output is also low the boolean expression for the or gate is c is equal to a plus b next one is not gate the not gate is represent as inverter gate or otherwise complementary gate here only one of the input signal is produces only one output signal here it is one of the two table for not gate the input signal is opposite to that of output signal here the input is zero means the output is high the input is one means the output is low the boolean expression for not gate is b is equal to a bar 
totally two gates are universal building block what are the universal building block means land gate and nor gate land and nor gate is called as the universal building block the first one is the nand gate the nand gate the operation of nand gate is two or more input signal produces only one output signal here a and b is input c is called as the output the truth table of the nand gate is if any one of the inputs are low the output is also high if both inputs are high means the output is low the boolean expression for nand gate is c is equal to a dot b whole bar the next slide is nor gate the nor gate two or more input signal produces only one output signal the combination of four input signal nor gate is if both inputs are low the output is high if any one of the input is high the output is low the boolean expression for nor gate is c is equal to a plus b whole bar the next slide is ascii and gray codes is the ascii code is an alpha numeric code it refers to letters numbers and symbol here the ascii code is used for data communication in digital computers the ascii code is stand for american standard code for information interchange the ascii code is a 7 bit code what is mean by 7 bit code means it represents the b02 b06 that is a 7 bit code next one is the ascii represented as ansi what is mean by ansi american national standard institute here the 7 bit rap code represented as 2 power 7 2 power 7 means 128 characters are present or otherwise 2 power 8 means it will be presented in 256 characters as are presented in ascii code here the tables are given how many binary numbers how many octal numbers the octal and hexadecimal are represented in characters by using ascii code the next slide is gray code gray code is known as non weighted code or otherwise it not an arithmetic code here exhibit only a single bit code change from change from other bit code in sequence order here how to know conversion is converted into binary to gray code gray code to binary how to convert this both way the first one is binary to gray code how to convert binary to gray code here the binary numbers are given these are the binary numbers the binary numbers are converted to gray code for example totally five digit five digits are present in binary method here one totally five digits are present the binary the five digits are represented as binary number here you take the first digit one the one is put here next thing in sequence order first digit will be added to second digit first of all you know the addition table what is the addition table 0 plus 1 equal to 1 1 plus 0 equal to 1 0 plus 0 is equal to 0 1 plus 1 is equal to 1 0 here 0 is sum 1 is carry here the carry is no needed only you put the sum so here the first digit is 1 the 1 is put here next in manner the first digit will be added to second digit so for example 1 plus 1 is equal to 1 0 only you take sum there is no need in carry again second step will be added to third step the second step 1 plus 1 is 0 again third step will be added to fourth step 1 plus 1 is equal to 0 again fourth step will be added to fifth step so 1 plus 1 is equal to 0 so these are the binary number the binary number is converted to gray codes next one is gray code to binary here the gray codes are given the given the gray code is converted into binary number here totally five digits are present the first digit one the one is represent here next in sequence order top bottom to top in sequence order bottom to top so that means 1 plus 1 is equal to 0 next 0 plus 0 is equal to 0 again 0 plus 1 is equal to 
1 plus 1 is equal to 0. Here the grey code is converted into binary. Next one is the XS3 code. The XS3 code is obtained by adding 001 to the corresponding BCD equivalent binary number. Here for example 4 is decimal number. First you take the decimal number. The decimal number is converted into BCD number. Afterwards you get the XS3 code. Here the 4 is decimal number. The decimal number is converted to BCD number. BCD value means 0100. Adding with 001 you get the XS3 code. Here 0 plus 1 is equal to 1. 0 plus 1 is equal to 1. 1 plus 0 is equal to 1. 0 plus 0 is equal to 0. Plus 0, is equal to 0. So, here the 4 is decimal number, 0100 is represent the BCD number, 001 is represent adding number, totally finally you get the XS3 code that value is 0111. Here represent the table also given. What is the table? Here the first one is these are the decimal number, second one is the BCD number, third one is the XS3 code. For example, the value is the value of BCD number. The value of BCD number is adding with 001 to get the XS3 code is obtained. Today, discuss about digital electronics. All of you understand about the topic. We will meet with next topic. Thank you to all.